While attention is centered on AMNO the past few days, our focus shifts to DAP, or more specifically the DAP Socialist Youth DAPSI, who is having an election this Saturday. The Wings Federal Territory's Publicity Secretary, Raja Ahmad Iskandar Faris, says this particular election is crucial for the wing as it aims to rejuvenate its leadership to navigate an ever-challenging political landscape. Uh, the rejuvenation in leadership uh, is slated to inject a renewed spirit uh, to build a better tomorrow for Malaysia. And with this, uh, a new approach, a new idea, hopefully a new outward uh, perspective to show that we are a multiracial uh, party with multiracial background and we are committed, we are stepping up our commitment to be a party for all Malaysians. Uh, I admit inspiring a new generation of change makers uh, might not be an easy task, but it has to start today. We have to show that we are beyond uh, surface level looking at skin color or backgrounds. We are looking at the ideas, the policies, and what plans we have to put in place to address the concerns of Malaysians uh, across the board. We might have uh, different ways of, um, uh, of showing our faith, uh, di different upbringing, but we have same concern. So the actions we take today in terms of changing mindsets or changing people's views and beliefs uh, in how we interact with uh, our political system will not just impact the near future as we gear up for the upcoming general elections, but it will also impact in the, the medium and longer term, 5, 10 to 15 years to come. Iskandar is one of the aspiring candidates for the DAPSI National Vice Chief. When asked what are the main issues the wing aims to highlight, this was his reply. Reviving livelihoods in the terms of uh, getting or creating better jobs, um, social safety net, um, empowering talent, uh, whether it young talent or uh, young working professionals, this will be the core at the forefront of uh, the, the lineup. Uh, whichever leadership uh, managed to secure uh, the uh, positions at this election uh, has to uh, look into these issues uh, very closely because um, as we've seen in multiple elections before this, bread and butter issues, livelihood issues will be at the front and center of voters.